Hello and welcome to the EMP Tech Group. Well, another project rolling through here today. Today's um, uh, subject is barcode verification. Uh, something we do a lot of here, something that's kind of a niche uh, product. Customers kind of tend to ignore barcode verification until there's a calamity and then all of a sudden everybody needs it. It's like insurance. Uh, so Jake has got a project he's installing this week. It's with a good customer of ours up in the Chicago area. And they are laser marking on uh, these, these um, hard metal stainless steel products that you can see over here. And then um, need to actually then do a secondary operation where they do verification. So Jake's been prepping for all this, has got some hardware set up here. So Jake, tell us what you've got here and uh, tell, tell us about the work that you're going to do to help the customer get this rolling. And I'll kind of zoom in on this verifier. Over um, here too. So we've got the 475 verifier um, set up for direct part mark. It's got this uh, optional light that does some different angles. And then there's also a 90 degree light built into this section here. So this is Cognex's uh, uh, DM475 verifier, right? Yep. So it's built around the, the high-end data man uh, products. You can actually use this verifier for in motion, uh, not for high speed in motion, but you can verify in motion as well. Uh, but in this case, it's stationary. And some of the products um, you need to not use that big ring light on to get close enough into them. And then some of them you need to use that ring light. So you'll that will the customer kind of swap that ring light on and off based on their needs? Yeah, it's just it's four bolts. Okay. Allen wrench to take got it. Off. Okay, cool. So you've got the hardware and there's a fixture there that's not the in, intended end fixture. The customer will build some custom uh, fixturing to uh, get the products exactly where they need to be under the camera. And then Jake, I'm going to go over to your screens here because you've got the software up and going. So I know you can't see exactly what's going on, but we'll get a general feel for what the software looks like here. Show us what you've got there. Um, so it runs off of the standard data man setup tool that you'd use for any other data man. Okay. That's yeah. on your right screen. And then yep. on your left screen is the verification software. Yeah. So it automatically pulls this up. Once you connect to a verifier. Okay. Can you grab an image and show us that? Yeah. So if you go live, um, this is how you would verify. You, so you can position your part and get your barcode lined up in the center. This red okay. uh, crosshair will always be there. Then you just kind of draw a box just around the outside of the barcode. And this is a one-time training. You'll, you'll set it up this way. And then if you verify this part again, it'll kind of know all of this. And it'll, um, it, it, you don't have to do this every time. This is a one and done thing. Yeah, so once you're lined up, hit verify. And it'll give you a grade. Um, there's different tabs up here. You go through all the breakdowns. Okay. Oh, nice. You can <clears throat> automatically save your report to a certain spot. And this is like the printout report that you'll get. Gotcha. Much all of those things combined on a PDF. And this is an AIM DPM. So we're actually grading to the AIM DPM, or is there an ISO standard that we're grading the, to? This is the DPM, but okay. there's also an ISO option. Got it. And then show that manual you've got there. I wanna, <laughs> I wanna, yeah. I'm gonna have to unzoom <laughs> because that thing's so big. So this is to validate your reader. And there's about 80 pages to go through on here with different setups and they have a couple sheets of barcodes that you have to so in order for this to all be legit and to be to the aim dpm standards you got to go through this whole 80 page validation process to get yeah. this thing set up yeah so you'll set up for a barcode scan it you put your results in and repeat that i mean we're on page 73 and there's 100 195 right there so oh there's a God. lot of a lot of okay. different steps so the, the, the bad news is to get this thing really set up and humming the way you need it, there's a lot of work to do. The good news is we know how to do it and we can you know really help expedite that work and pretty well do it for the customer. So you're going to go up this week and, and install and deliver this and, and help show the customer all of this documentation and what they need to do. Cool. All right. Well, uh, more good work going on here at the MP Tech Group. One thing I'll finish with is this is one kind of verifier that we sell. We sell the verifiers that go on the actual label printers and, and uh, verify as you're printing labels. We sell paper-based, just handheld verifiers, or we sell kind of this Mac Daddy 
you know, big time verifier as well. And uh, our folks here are trained to uh, install and service and help with all of these. So emptechgroup.com is a place to catch us. And uh, we look forward to working with you on your barcode verification.